so live stream should be back up. I think Chris was currently watching the live stream. Um, one thing with my Wi-Fi and stuff I'm having to figure out, uh, likes to go out sometimes, and I haven't quite figured that out yet. I like how everything else is looking right now on the live stream. Actually, super happy with how everything else is looking. Um, so Chris, I only have one. I swear, I'm going to be opening up some more um, Darkness and Blaze sometime in the next couple days. But I do got a couple. Um, so if you if you are here still... Uh, so no one's here right now. So I'm going to give it a couple more minutes. I got some codes here potentially. If you are interested. Let's go ahead and hop back into another match. Uh, my Wi-Fi went out there for a second, Chris. Sorry about that. Um, Chris, if you are ready, I will flash a couple for the Cosmo. I thought I had more Darkness of Blaze coats here, but it's a mix between Sword and Shield and Rebel Clash. Um, if you do want these ones, I'll flash these up on the screen in just a second. Once I start kind of growing a little bit more and stuff, I'm going to do more stuff over on TikTok is where I upload a lot of daily stuff. Um... I do want to kind of do some kind of like giveaway with codes and stuff. Um, that's some stuff planned in the long future. But there's still a lot of stuff from Sword and Shield and just kind of collecting the codes too. Um, what are some? There's some other products too. Um, Eternatus. Can you whisper them to me? I, I don't know actually how quickly. If I flash them on the screen. Let me see, whisper them to you. Um, I'm kind of noob when it comes to live streaming. This is the first time I've talked to someone in real time. Uh, so let me see. I wonder if I can just mess. Oh, whisper. Oh, cool. That's a, that's a feature on here. Uh, yeah. Here, I've got some, I got a couple coats here. Rebel Clash. I know I had one of them was a Dark of Blaze. I have three, a couple Rebel Clash coats here right now. Um, so one other. Let me go ahead and see what I'm playing against right now. I can do this while... Information, cool. Still learning all this, how all this Twitch stuff works. Totally new to it. But these are going to be some codes. And then she can go ahead and redeem quest, Chris. Um, totally fine with that. And then I plan to do more more code, code giveaways in the future. Let me get through my turn really quickly. I'll get through that. Um, get those to you. Um, but yeah, Chris, there's tons of ways. It's like Pokemon is like the trading card game is the, the thing you're like, hey, this is the game I want to play and go for it. Uh, there are definitely ways to play on it on it on a budget. I know you're looking for the Eternatus VMAX code. Um, of course, I don't know what like your situation is or if your uh, parents are able to get you help you get the codes or anything too. Uh, there's a lot of websites where you can buy the codes uh, too. If that's not an option too, there's uh, other places and stuff and kind of grinding. Um, uh, let me see. What do I want to grab? We're gonna be discarding most. Of this. Most most of my opening hands with ADP do it does involve me usually getting rid of a lot of things right off the bat. Um, actually, yeah. Let's go ahead and grab the day first. Hopefully, we can get this alter creation off turn one. Actually, pretty pretty. We're set up at least or in a position to depending what supporter I hit. I could use the Marnie. That's that's a valid. Um, so I waited to hold the Marnie down. So in the event that I had a su another supporter, I have a lot of supporters in this deck. So the, I go for the Dedenne first to hopefully um, to hopefully be able to hit one of my bigger supporters. And so then I'm able to chain it because had I Marnied first, I would have drawn into less cards. So um, I went for I went for the option of using the Dedenne first. Um, but I could have used Marnie too, and that also there's reason to use him. Um, this entire hand is about to go bye bye, uh, but there is one thing I want to do here. I am going to want to discard at least one metal saucer, so I'm super close to getting this alter creation, this first turn alter creation off. I am one or two cards away from making this happen. Um, but I'm gonna try to slow him down too. Let's see. 
you have a lower tree cost. Normally I'd save Great Catcher for later in the game. It doesn't make too much of a difference. Um, this Charizard has a super high, super high attack cost, so I am going to bring him up to the front. Um, because he has to do, do a lot of things, so he has to switch out and stuff. We are... Okay, no. Nope, didn't, didn't quite get the Alter Creation off this turn, but... Um... I've been... <laughs> uh, I haven't I haven't been able to hit a heads all night. I think that's got to be my... I think I've hit one tails tonight. Uh, but that's the nature of this of this game. Okay, so we'll be able to do stuff next turn if he doesn't get rid of things. Let me whisper some of those codes over. Um, I didn't know whisper was a feature till now, uh, Chris, so thank you for bringing that to my attention. Uh, let's see, R29... Oh, my R29... L... B... D... Oh. At, fir at first when you said whisper them to you I thought you meant that in like the literal sense <laughs> Chris so I apologize about that I'm showing my uh, age here that I'm old and I don't understand understand things anymore or right, 2 nine I'm getting reset stamp that's fine L B cool so this first one that's coming to you is a cosmic eclipse one uh, these are the ones I just have around me. This next one's going to be a Rebel Clash one. Yeah, of course. Like I said, I plan to do bigger things in the future as I keep growing and stuff. Um, if you have a TikTok or anything too, I make daily content over there. Those, A lot of those videos are just fun videos. Me showing off my collection. The community over on TikTok has been super awesome. Um, and over on you, my YouTube channel... Um, I make, uh, I'm trying to make week weekly videos about, like, how to play the trading card game and stuff, too. Okay, it's fine. okay, let's give this a shot. Um, I wasn't paying attention here, so he, his firebox Mew is ready to, to destroy me. Okay, um... I still think I just go off of the turn one alter creation. Uh, I'm gonna lose my ADP next turn, but he still has to be able to retreat out too. So, so I think we just kind of go for it. Accept the loss if if he gets knocked out. Uh, I should take advantage of what we have in my hand right now, because he could whiff on a switch, and if that happens, I'd be happy about that. So. <laughs> next turn that ADP is probably going to go down we'll have a lot of draw support next turn cool let's just go for it um yeah alter creation one of the most busted attacks that's been made in the entire game most of the time Chris I stream mostly on Sunday Sunday nights Oh, sweet. And he whiffed. He did not have a switch in his hand. That is fantastic. Now I feel really good about winning this match. Or one step closer. Boss's order up. Let's grab one of those Adenes. Let's go ahead and knock him out. Um, so next turn, this AP will get knocked out. Most definitely. But we're one turn away then from... One boss's order away from, um, from winning the match. Let's see. Got a couple more coming your way. My stream is still going. Cool. One, two. Jesus. X. Let's go ahead and get you these codes. T. Q. K. Nine. R. L. Four. L. D. N.
film. And um, if you're interested too, Chris, I'm going to be doing, I'll probably be opening up some darkness. Uh, I thought I had more darkness of blaze codes around here, um, but there's still a lot of things from these sets. Um, other codes, if I actually open it, this would actually, did he have the code in here? Sweet. Cool, Chris. I'm about to give you a cool code right now too. Um, I have this one out. I haven't opened up this other box yet, so that would take a second to get through. Um, so this one, uh, actually, let me get through. It's my turn right now, and I'm going to give you a cool code uh, before before I go to. And this will actually help you. Um, I don't know what other decks you have right now, um, but this code I have right here will actually help you build kind of something similar to my opponent's deck right now. Um, it'll have Reshazards and stuff inside their welders and stuff. Um, but uh, let's go ahead and take this guy down first. Um, one more Dedenne in there. Dedenne, sweet. Okay, so boss's order, boss's order. Ooh, I only have one. Do I really have two? So one boss's order is prized. So this is going to be... I think I already used that Grey Catcher earlier. So this is going to be tough to get. And I have to draw a lot of cards and I don't have... But I have, I have to go for it. Um, I can place you down. <laughs> uh, let's see. Still working on that code. Um, energy switch. Yeah, so I'm going to... Okay, this all makes sense in a second. Energy switch there. We're going to play the energy switch to move the energy back. Um, metal saucer. But we're, we're still going to get to draw a ton of cards here. So I can bench this Mala while I can bench these guys safely. Uh, Viridian Force, I'm going to use that to discard that Marnie. Get that Marnie out of here. Let's see what's in my opponent's hand real quick, too. Ooh, ooh absolutely. Let's push down that Crobat V down into play, too. Mala, one of my favorite cards in this format, just for that exact scenario. And just like that, we were able to thin out my hand. And boss's order for game. Let's go ahead and knock out another Dedenne. And we take our three prizes. And just like that, three prizes. Let's see, how do I get back to that? Cool. Do this real quick for you, Chris. Just because I like to try to spread the, spread the love for Pokemon. Um, it's sad, uh, Chris, that right now we're not in a time where you can play at in-person Pokemon events. The past year, all the way 2018 through 2019, all the way up to the beginning of this year, I traveled uh, around the country playing in Pokemon tournaments and like convention centers and stuff. And it was some of the funnest times that I ever had. Um, and even the local Pokemon community is awesome. I have taught I have taught plenty of kids how to play the Pokemon game, how to play more competitively. Um, this code is going to be super cool. This is to the Reshiram, uh, Reshiram Charizard Battle League deck. So it'll have all these cards inside here. Um, I never redeemed this one. I already have every single card that's in here, so I don't need it. Um, whether you want to build Firebox, kind of use some of these things, or build other decks with this too. Um, <laughs> look out of luck. Gods, lend me your power. Sweet. Chris, I'm happy I can help you with this one. Let me t give you this code. This is for Reshiram and Charizard. Um, Reshiram and Charizard has kind of gone down a little bit on the tier list, but he still is viable. Like, uh, actually, let me show you one of the lists that I have built with him. Actually, we'll play with a little bit of Reshiram Charizard. Q, K, Y, M2, M2, G2. Cool. This, this code I'm whispering to you right now will have some Reshiram Charizards and a bunch of other cool stuff. Um, so to say the least, still really good. Um, the other things in it are more manageable to get. You can also use those if you want to try to trade towards Eternatus. Um, I'm not going to lie, Chris. Uh, getting uh, I have Eternatus V built, he was tough. Even he, he was spendy even for me to build. Um, He's he's tough to get because you uh, to play him optimally. It's a four line of Crobat, Eternatus, uh, four and four of these guys. Uh, there's ways to get around it, but he's he's a tough one to kind of still um, still get built. 
but there's still a lot of other really good decks too and then kind of grinding towards him uh if i had more of those guys um i have a couple friends that i'm trying to help build uh build him right now too but i'm gonna go ahead um powers let's see actually yeah let's do Reshazard. Reshazard is cool um website i use if you are in a position or ever i don't know if you have your allowance money or anything like that or you sell um i remember when i was a kid i used to recycle um uh, cans and bottles and stuff that's how i used to pay for video games and stuff and uh code cards are cheaper uh, for sure than uh, the website i use is po town that's p-o-t-o wnstore.com it's ran by a league it's ran by people who play pokemon competitively and there's a lot of places on there where you can redeem uh darkness of blaze codes those do cost some money but it is um three component three verse minus you have two half four extra scoop up nets let me see how many scoop up nets i have right now i could spare let's see i need four um actually you need four scoop nets go ahead and uh chris add me on ptcgo one two three four nine four and i'd still have five left i do have a couple scoop of nets for trade um if you if you have anything go ahead and mark something for trade um like i said i'm not really looking for anything specific um i have adult money so i can find <laughs> i can uh but yeah i can actually help there with that if you're if you're interested um mark something for trade like i said i'm not i'm not picky about things um i don't know what you have in your collection um are we what's up uh yeah my username is Lobby. I'm at the, uh, the PTCGO lobby or guitarist. Um, if you also put your username in the chat, then I can add you too. get that um go ahead chris put your name in the user chat too i'm gonna go ahead because uh, i want to go hop into one more match real quick um i'm going to play with probably just adp again if i'm being honest uh, and i think there's one other <laughs> uh three people i'm watching the live stream here you're here right now chris so that means there's one more mysterious person watching the live stream so whoever that person is thank you for checking out the live stream too i see that you're there um I'm going to go ahead and hop into one more match real quick, Chris. Uh, cool. I'll check that out in just a second. Your username to Chris. Uh, actually, let's see. Did it go through? And... Uh, Not popping up quite yet. We'll go ahead. I'll be on here for a little bit too. If you can put it in the chat, then I can search you. I don't mind searching yours too. Um, and scoop up net too. He can't be going for more than a few packs right now too.
the um just ptc geo in general they need to have a better way to just search for stuff too searching for usernames searching for for everything the website uh i like the interface i like how they do the booster packs and everything but it just just all of it could be better like there are, there are some cards chris that are darn near impossible to get on ptc geo anymore um I'm thinking about the card Tropical Beach in expanded format. Uh, oof. Oof, that did Danny start. Awesome. Oh, I'll look your name up after this match. I think you mentioned you started playing... But GX, that's a that's a good that's a good one too. Kill Santa Scorch. Oh, I feel pretty good about this matchup. Let's see. Let's cherish ball. This dude. Uh, it's my first turn right now, so I won't I can't attack. I can't even do a whole lot. Let's see. Actually, going first, I still think is optimal. Um, even in this situation, yeah. Well, this is pretty, pretty good stuff right here. So grab that water energy. See what else is prized. I think I have one water energy prized. Water energy. A. A professor's research is prized. Water energy. Professor's research. No, a steel energy prize. Steel energy. I run nine water, uh, nine steel energy, so that's prized. Actually, we can go ahead and grab because I'm gonna go ahead and discard this entire hand. Anyways, this will be nice to retreat. I'll go ahead and grab a, a dog so we can intrepid sword this turn. Super strong starting starting hand actually. No, that's a uh, that sounds like a pretty solid list you're working on. Um, I think you mentioned, um, Chris, that you started playing Pokemon kind of recently. Is that correct? It's a uh, super fun. I love this community. I love playing Pokemon, specifically the trading card game. I finally got through uh, Sword and Shield. Admittedly, I played Sun and Moon. I never played Ultra Sun and Moon. Um, ooh, and a strong Intrepid Sword too. Two Steel Energy. Nice. Oh, I don't know whether or not that I'll go for. I think I'll. Uh, which, I actually, are you talking about the Fire Volcanian? I actually don't know how many of those guys I have. I know I was low on those, um, but I can, but I can take a look though. Two more Volcanians, yeah, because you'll have. Let me see. This one come with any phone. Because then you'll almost be able to build fire with the fire code. I'll check. I'll check after this this match too. The fire dude. Cool. Hello to people who are checking out the live stream right now. I'm just doing some late night grinding on the Pokemon ladder and it is almost midnight already so I'll probably be on here for about 30 more minutes. Um, just getting early, early, early grind on the ladder a little bit. I'm getting ready for a couple Pokemon tournaments right now. Um, Pokemon is doing their player cup again that starts I don't know if it started Pokemon is so Pokemon has not done a good uh Timon Chan hi five uh hello Timon Chan five six six how you doing um absolutely go ahead and ask a question it's weird there's people actually in that I'm talking to right now virtually this is this is this is new for me um Oh, heads up to uh, just so you guys know. Sometimes I haven't quite worked out all the kinks with like trying to do live streams and stuff. So sometimes 
it likes to just randomly stop working. Uh, I'm trying to work that one out right now. Uh, uh, but yeah, so I'm getting ready, getting ready for some Pokemon tournaments. There's some local ones that are going on online too. I'm in a bunch of like Pokemon Facebook groups um, and things like that. Uh, but I can't wait to be back in person playing in real Pokemon events. It, there's nothing quite like it. Um, if any of you guys are interested in what that's kind of like, I have a, a couple Pokemon vlogs I were up on my channel. So, uh, fun fact, Pokemon TCG Daily. I can... I don't actually know what Flapple and Avalon's. I don't even... I don't actually know if I know what guy that is. I'll check that. I can check up... Um, Google search him real quick over here what he is. Um... But Pokemon TCG Daily actually came from, the name came from my YouTube channel in 2018. I uploaded a, uh, uh, I'll answer that question in a second, Oli Gold DC. Um, so in 2018, I did a Pokemon booster pack opening every single day for an entire year straight, at least one booster pack without missing a single day. I went all the way through, it was April of April of 2019, I think, is when I finally actually stopped doing that. And in 2021, I might bring that back. I actually have started, uh, in case you guys also do want to follow me anywhere else, uh, the main place I upload daily content now is over on TikTok of all places. I did not, under the same name, Pokemon TCG Daily, I did not think I was going to have fun over there. Um, my girlfriend was the one who got me into even downloading it. Uh, but I've had a super fun time. To answer your question, though, do I think ADP is too strong and needs a ban? I am still in the camp of that. I understand the reasoning and people's reasoning for wanting him to get banned, but so two years ago, people complained about Zorik GX. That was the big guy on top. Um, even before, what really changed ADP was getting a guy like Zacian, something that could just stack energy. I think once you start trying to ban one card, there is always going to be another guy that people are going to want to get banned um i just don't think it's going to stop um what i do think adp needs i think he needs something that can be a hard counter to him uh if we had something like pokemon ranger back in the format uh that just kind of prevented uh, pokemon ranger which could remove uh remove ultra creation from taking effect that'd be really great uh right now fairy pokemon aren't even a thing anymore in sword and shield is the problem since Luke? Uh, yeah, uh, Luke Metal is also pretty is also pretty strong, um, and I do agree with that. I understand. I, I totally understand. There's there's plenty of awesome valid reasons for him to be banned. Um, my biggest thing is maybe we got an Rata, uh, and just just some kind of thing to put him in place, because the best decks. These are the three best decks I think are in format right now: ADP, Eternatus, and then any kind of Mew variation. Um, and even, even as busted, Eternatus is one of those cards that right out the gate is just good. It's it's kind of crazy. The last card I can think of that was just good right off the bat was when Reshiram and Charizard first came out. He was just instantly good. Uh, he, they gave him all the support he needed. Um, but there still is such a huge gap even between ADP and Eternatus. There's no denying that between those two cards that there is a power struggle. And my poor dog is going to get knocked out. But I'm going to go ahead and knock out... And this is going to be exactly uh, one of those parts of this match where I am going to see a uh, perfect example, uh, proving, proving your point, uh, um, why ADP is too good, because I'm about to do a lot of things this turn. So I don't need this Copper Jaw this turn. Uh, I think we'll probably just grab another dog. Uh, yeah, that sounds pretty good. I just need to hit one... One energy. Turbo patch here. I'll probably grab that crowbat from earlier. Um, maybe before I overthink this. Attach energy search. Yeah, because I want to be able to search him out though. So I need to play it. I need to play it now. I'm actually gonna run out of cards, I think. Um No, this is what we're this is what we're gonna do. Ah shoot, my live stream is probably just about to go out and I'll kick it back up in a second. Um, is it staying on? It's staying on. Sweet. Um, when the little Wi-Fi symbol starts, like, blinking on PTCGO, that's usually an indication that um, my live stream is just about to go out also. So we just need to hit one energy. I'm actually kind of low on energy right now, too, in my deck. No, I'm not. That was last match. Boss's order up. Bring that to Dene out there. You just need to hit one energy off this 
and then we're golden. Energy, energy, hit that. Let's bump this. Bump this guy. Um, nope, not really anything else I need to do this turn. Um, so, yeah, maybe he should be, <laughs> maybe he should be banned. But Pokemon is making more products for him. They're releasing a Zacian, not uh, not a Zacian tin, or, or something that inc I think includes both of them. Um, but even if I were to go back two years though, when Zork GX was in the format, um, uh, every everyone thought DCE should be banned too. Um, it didn't get banned, but this is pretty busted. This is extremely busted. And that's why I'm playing most of the time. Uh, I play when we were back at in-person events, I played a lot more rogue decks. Um, just because right now in this current situation, I don't have a lot of opportunities to play in tournaments, so I want to play it safe and play meta. Um, I've won two League Cups, um, so I have won two kind of higher profile tournaments. One of those was is what is what was considered with a rogue deck. Uh, that was with Team Up Charizard. Before even we had all this fire support, I got extremely... Actually, I have that play mat out right now. Um, do I have my other webcam with me? How do I want to show this? I do do a little monkeying around here. To show this, but this was the first, um, first playmat that I won in my first Pokemon tournament. I actually have it out right now. This was one of my pride and joys of my Pokemon items that I have. That was a really good day. This, uh, this champion Gengar Mimikyu playmat, one of my favorite Pokemon things that I own in my collection for sure. For sure. I think that was one of my favorite formats to play in. That would have been the beginning of Team Up. That was I do. That was a fun format. So, Oli uh, Bullock, um, this is my way of saying, okay, cool. Do I have a game here? I just sent you a couple, uh, I'm going to be sending you a couple codes and stuff just to say thanks for checking out the live stream. I handed out a couple over to Chris a little bit ago. Um, I always have extra codes and stuff lying around too. It's, um, I have a couple from some things I've been opening lately. I have game. Yeah. Right here. Get those got a couple codes to send to you and then i was actually going to do a trade with chris real quick to you good counter to adp uh mewtwo uh water mew i lost to it actually a couple matches ago chris was here uh chris was here for that i think these are yeah the codes i'm sending you right now um only full code is these are cosmic eclipse codes i had a ton of um I don't know when I got all these cosmic eclipse codes. This would have been a while ago. Long term, I plan to do more kind of giveaways and stuff. Um, I'm still right now in the process of testing the waters between this channel, doing things over on TikTok. Um, I'm trying to get a. Uh, Those are for you, Chris. Go for it. Um, cool. Real quickly, guys. I'm going to do one trade. I'm helping Chris get a couple scoop of nets. I have a couple extra in my collection. He's working on building Eternatus right now. So I'm going to add him real quick. Do that. My uh, username is GuitarsMB. If any of you guys ever want to get in, get in or challenge me at some point, that'd be fun too. Let me see. L E K E K R K R K R K R K Cool. I just sent you a friend request, Chris, if you're still here. Um Okay, okay. Cool. I just added you, Chris. I played Mega Latios. 
and Volcanians. Let me double check that real quick too. I might only have a place at Volcanian. I think I kind of want to keep these ones. Um, I think these ones are the ones I got from pre-release. Um, uh, I have... Let's see. I could spare. I usually only run... Oh, this one's locked. Um, <laughs> just because I'm... Wait, are, are these guys included anything else too? Let me check real quick. I don't think they were put in any other booster pack decks or anything. No, I don't think I don't think he was putting any of these things. Um, actually, before the end of night two guys, I'm gonna do. Um, let's see. I'll go ahead. So I have the scoop of nuts ready, Chris. We can go ahead and work something to trade out there. Um, before the end of the night two, I'll probably do some booster pack openings, just some live ones. So there's actually people here to watch, which is cool. Um, I played May. Let me try again, Chris. Let me try to add you again. E. K -E. Okay, RK. Okay, RK. Cool. Add it again. I'll do a couple of these practices. I mean, I played Mega Audio's Never Break a while in the top four. Top four at a League Cup out of 56 Masters. Nice job, to, Um, That's awesome. That was a fun deck, too. Um. So we'll do some booster pack. Um, I kind of want to do one more match anyways. Uh, uh, yeah, we're going to do one more match. And then I think we'll also do some... I got a ton ton of booster packs on here that can open. Maybe we can try to get Chris to one more. Because uh, I think I kind of want to hold on to those Volcanians since those ones do have the stamp on here. Um, let's mix it up. I want to play something not meta right now. Uh, my other favorite deck that I have loved since I was... A, I did not think Charizard V was going to be viable. I've had some fun matches with him. Is it is it a tier one deck? No. Um, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry, Chris. I don't know why it's not. Let me try one more time, Chris. Add friends. And then E. Ali. K-R-K. Um, and if you want to, uh, Chris, too, if you can add me there, too, you can add me at... I'm going to go ahead. I'll send this to you, too, so you can just copy it and paste it to the uh, and Whisper. My username is GuitarisMB. I'm sending you my username now, so you can just copy and paste this. Um, but let's go ahead and get... Uh, I'm going to showcase this deck. I really love Charizard V. Um, the part I like about this deck, I would not build this deck in real life because this deck would be stupid expensive. Oh, I got to show off a little bit too. Um, this has been a super great set for me. Uh, I haven't, oh, I've opened less than 20, probably less than 20 uh, Darkness of Blaze booster packs. And I pulled two of these guys. <laughs> I was happy. I was pretty happy about them. They're going for over, easily going for over 100 bucks a piece right now. Super happy I was get these guys. So in real life, I would not be building Charizard V, um, because he'd be so, he'd be so expensive. Um, yeah. So really happy, really happy that I was able to pull two of these guys. I'm probably gonna. I don't know. I don't know if I should sell them or get them graded. I haven't decided yet. But this has definitely been my... As I drop one of them behind my desk, I'm glad that was in a sleeve. Champion Pass said, My wallet is not ready for Champion Pass. <laughs> uh, my wallet is not ready for Champion Pass. I'm not... I mean, uh, yeah, I'm probably going to go... I didn't do any pre-orders, so I have to go to my stores um, first thing, like when they get there. But I'll at least buy... I'll buy a couple things. There's some smaller boxes and stuff they're doing from GameStop too that I'm probably going to pre order. I'll get one. I'll get one ETB. I'll get one ETB at least. I always say I'm only going to get one. Um, I got some digital booster packs. And if you guys want to, I could. I have to do this kind of in real time too and grab my web camera. Um, I am also ready to do some booster pack openings. I have a ton of product to open right now. Oh, this is an interesting matchup. Right. I mean, I'm playing a different deck. I still thought I was doing ADP here. Um, we're in a really good spot right now. Um, let's find out where we get off this. Let's start 
kind of want to get a couple more cards. So the game plan is let's get Charizard here. Let's just get Charizard out here first. Um, and uh, Team Onan, five, five, uh, 566 or whatever your other parts are. Uh, back to back, please. My luck is never this good. Your luck is this good, Chris, because you're on my live stream right now. That's got that's got to be it. Awesome. Happy to hear. Happy happy to hear that. Um, I think it's really cool, Team Monin, that you've played in Pokemon events. I I can't wait to be playing back uh, in Pokemon events. And nothing beats. Uh, I'm super happy. I have a PTCGO to supplement this, uh, but nothing beats in person Pokemon events. Um, probably could have discarded a triple boost probably would have not discarded a charizard um so if this deck pops off uh charizard v max i did not think was going to be a viable card and then i started playing around with it we got another charizard that worked out um if i can just hit one like a pokecom or something that quick ball is okay i could have done a couple things here differently um but i have had this has definitely been my fun rogue deck Back to back, just pulled. UV, cool. We'll definitely do some booster pack openings and stuff. This is an awesome night. Um, leaving behind my desk. So, we'll, yeah. Maybe we can do some actual booster pack openings too. That's something you guys want to see. Currently, I have about eight more. How many of these? So these are the double. These are the ones that they were selling these at Target a lot. I'm not seeing them there as much anymore. I got really lucky. Uh, I went to Barnes & Noble last week. I did not know Barnes & Noble was open. Uh, me and my girlfriend just kind of were driving by there. And they had four more of these just sitting on the shelves. Super happy about that. Um, no. Cool. But yeah, we'll at least open some digital packs. I'm going to get over to helping Chris. And let's see. there for now Let's see what we got over here for codes sweet and the full hopeful play set of nothing the tough part with Vickovolt Vickovolt is still a good one of in like if early on if you're if you are trying to run Pigarom and stuff uh, he's still kind of good there Oh my, I'm totally not paying attention to my opponent. He totally popped off. <laughs> uh, 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 what's good, because people were really hyping Vickovolt there for a minute. Um, he was good pre-rotation, but then he lost a lot of stuff. Um, so, a couple things should happen this turn. I can hit another Welder. I potentially can knock him out without having it. How do I want to do this? To bump this again. I've been lucky hitting my stadiums. Uh, stellar wish first. Mm, Eldegoss, I can get Welder back. Actually, a couple things I wanted to do there. Yeah, so Vil Vikavol was really good pre rotation, but then he lost a lot of stuff. I think he got. Didn't Pika Rom get first at, like, not the Mock World Championship or something like Something like that. Play Pika Hammers. Nice. Uh, if I could in my ADP list, the one thing I'm trying to find room to be extra greedy is to a place to find like two to four crushing hammers, uh, just for just for the mirror match. Okay, so he went for the victory there. Um, Timon uh, five five six six. Uh, in a second, I'm gonna whisper you some codes and stuff. I got some extra ones here. I've given codes to everyone who's been on this live stream. I have a feeling this notification up here is our friend Chris, who I'm gonna try to help get him some stuff. Cool. There we go. See you this time. I'm gonna go create a trade for you. You're the first one who kicked off this live stream. I think you said you needed four scoop of nets. I got a couple of those. I can spare. I like those volcanoes, but even volcanoes only a one of an attack. So this is me trying to help out. Um, let's see. Let me create a trade real quick. And we'll open some packs and stuff. Um, I'm gonna do one more match with that. Let's see. I am getting. Trade? How do you, I don't even know how a private trade? Let's see. Thank you guys for bearing with me for one second while I help out our buddy Chris over here. Um, Chris, like I said, I don't even really need anything. Uh, 
like I said, I have like everything. Let me let me go. Uh, whisper connected. Oh no. <laughs> Oh no! Um, it says it says you have Whisper. Uh, I I just discovered what Whisper is. Um, so I think if I click on this thing right here, it'll probably please don't enter. It'll probably be a notification that pops up on your end, anyways. Let me get let me help up my buddy real quick here. My buddy Chris. Uh, I got plenty of scoop of nuts to spend. I think you said one of four, four still leaving me a full place set. Chris, I'm gonna give me tonight. I have two, you're gonna get two really cool Volcanians. I only need one ever in attack, and I'm not using Volcanian too much anymore anyways. Volcanian. You said, you said two Volcanians, Chris. I'm not gonna think, you know my, um, if you can, make sure you follow Chris before if you, I think, I think you already did follow, so. Um, like I said, I just don't even need, like, anything right now so I don't want to take take your stuff if you can spare me a... ooh that was one of those um couple of those fire energy let's see if you have Chris if you're okay sparing those two fire uh two of those cool reverse hall of fire energy I'll go ahead and click create I'll go ahead and click uh, create the trade right now if you pop that over in the chat and I'll get you your two volcanians and scoop of nets Because those fire energy are actually pretty cool. Let's see. I'm going to help out our other friend real quick. And then we're going to go hop into some matches, do some more. Cool. Sounds good, Chris. In the future, I plan to do more. Pika Rom. Pika Rom is totally a th uh, totally a thing. It's still it's a lot slower than it used to be, um, but let's see. Let's see. Let me show you my let me show you my Pika Rom list. Thank you. Those energies are cool, Chris. Um, I hope I hope what yeah, you you've been here tonight and stuff. Gotten some people on here. I hope you're able to start building some stuff that you need. Um, those those volcanians are cool. Uh, so this is my current Pika Rom list. Um, it's I, I would put it down to a tier two at best, and it's kind of based off of where Pika Rom was kind of teetering off towards at the end, back in like uh, June or whatever when it started steering away from the Jirachi engine. Uh, I have this list still on here to try to take advantage of what Pika Rom does best: accelerate energy use Bolton to get a, um, Electrify off. And yes, this is correct. You see four Turbo Patches in here, because if I can get one heads on one of those, it makes a huge difference. Uh, kind of some other things. There was a really good match last night um, that I'll have to show in a second. Let me just show a match. Let me show a match with it. Um, I've liked this list uh, tier two at best, but even for someone who's like uh, trying to get into the game, it's still worth picking up one of these, one of these cool guys. Um, I haven't even opened up this one yet. I had so many Pokemon products and stuff, I was ready to build decks and try things out with, and then I just didn't, haven't needed to open them. <laughs> um, RZC. Then we're going to open up some other... D, 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 D. This has been one of my favorite, um, absolutely for sure, one of my favorite decks to play with. Let's see. Happy. It's a good time. I know a couple people are here right now. Um, oh, I also stream over on YouTube. Ooh, I haven't checked the YouTube chat. Um, actually, it's kind of helped not having this open. Okay, the YouTube one's been dead anyways. <laughs> uh, cool. Let's see. Do I want to go first? Yeah. So usually, guys. Um, I mean, Monday might Monday might be the new day. I try to do live streams. I've normally have been doing it on on uh, Tuesdays, but maybe maybe Monday's the day I should do it. Um, okay. So this is actually the perfect scenario um, of me of my hand that I want for this Pika Rom list. So I play exactly into what Pika Rom does best, uh, trying to get that tag build off. And there's still enough two prizes in this format. This is actually pretty. 
pretty ideal um, matchup, actually. Um, could dig a little bit more. Let's go ahead and take a look what's here. I probably will go ahead and Dene. Let's see. Probably grab another drink in a second. Uh, go ahead, Dene. Just go ahead and dig and see what's here. I saw that the Tapu Coco was there. Should have checked a little bit more in all that. Um, but not too shabby of a start. I would like to get... Uh, I'm not going to put Tapu Coco out here just for fear that he can't get attacked. Um, I feel pretty okay playing against this, this deck. Uh, here. One, six, seven. Uh, Timon and... Timon Han. We've got a couple coats coming your way right now. The Whisper. I don't know how it looks when it pops up on your end. Um... Chris was the one that brought him to my attention that uh, Whisper is a uh, chat option, so I can message, so I can message you guys privately. Um, as the channel grows, I plan to do like giveaways and stuff. Um, the ones, the ones I plan giveaways I plan to start doing first probably will be codes of some kind, um, just because it's easy to distribute those. Um, I can buy codes on Potown and various websites. Try to help build people's collection. Other places that I mentioned that I do, I do daily content um, just about every day over on TikTok. Those are more fun videos and stuff. Um, TT, so, and it's my turn real quick. Uh, that Marnie did hurt a little bit, but we can, we'll try to survive. We'll try to survive. That was a Marnie he hit me with, right? H K L D B D G. Cool. Alrighty, tomorrow on. There's three cosmic eclipse clothes codes waiting there for you. Go ahead and enjoy. And uh, I think we're fun in between in between uh, my next turn. Nice. <laughs> I'm glad I was able to help you make whatever you had to make. That honestly makes makes my makes me happy. Uh, try to just share the love of Pokemon. Um, okay, so now something else I got to be careful of. That's right. I'm remembering how this matchup goes. Uh, he's going to discard a lot of my energy potentially next turn. So I don't want to be dumb and just. Uh, stack all my energy out this turn. No, I think it's shuffle. I think it shuffles my energy back into my deck. Shuffles all energy cards from their Pokemon if he has at least three extra energy. And this counts as one of them. I have that boss's order, but unfortunately, I can't I can't even knock out Rillaboom anymore. Uh, I could knock out Grookey, but I don't think I do. Let's see. Ten seconds. Deal 30 damage with this Pokemon. Yeah, I'm just going to attack up front. A difference so if he ah shoot i ran out of turn gosh darn ah uh that was that was a rookie mistake on my part um but just for fun in between turns or whatever um you know i'm gonna do just for that match i kind of want to display a little bit better i'm gonna go ahead and scoop that match um that was pretty costly of me not being attacked uh, i think we'll open open some stuff um yeah in, in during the matches or whatever I kind of want to make my screen bigger for that too, or just switch around. There's a couple things I'm going to have to uh, figure out if I can even do them in a live setting. Uh, just as a heads up, it says there's a couple people actually watching. This is the longest I've kept the live stream going without it cutting out. Um, so occasionally the one kind of glitch I'm still working out with my current live stream setup is uh, Twitch just stopping. Um, so then I have to kick it back up. And Chris, I'm really happy to hear all that. Um, well, honestly, this might be something something I start doing again. I'm going to start doing on Mondays. Could be a good thing, too. I helped Chris, Chris out tonight. He was the first one that popped up in this chat. That's awesome. Um, Let's try another match with Pigaram. I didn't attack on that one turn. Um, Koba V and turn is VMAX. 
keep keep it up, Chris. Super close there. Um, I noticed on your trade it said you had 22 like uh, Darkness of Blaze packs. You you definitely can trade for at least one Crobat V or one Internatus V Max for sure. Um, Cool. While my opponent is in that turn, let's go ahead and open up a Pokemon Booster Pack while we're at it. What's Pokemon? Um, I think I got some, some open stuff already. Let's see. What do I want to open? That's a pretty, pretty good pack, actually, to open. Something, something... I open all of them. Ah, I see. Oh. This is probably one of the tougher matchups for Pika Ram. Current Pika Ram, at least. Uh, the strategy still stays the same. Um, put this here. Radiant Force. I'm not crazy about that. Um. Uh, Hopefully I can hit a switch. Actually, already one of my techs, I kind of, uh, it's unfortunate I, I started with the Zigzagoon. The Zigzagoon is kind of, uh, does really help with a lot of these matchups. Do one more match with Pika Rom. We at least get Accelerate Energy. And I kind of want to save that Wondrous Labyrinth too. I don't want it to Dene, but I'm... Let's see. Because that Wondrous Labyrinth could slow him down next turn. Or hurt me more. Let's just go ahead and attack. I'm not too, I'm not too stressed out about this match. This really is just a for fun deck. In between turns, let's open up a booster pack. I have a random uh, Detective Pikachu pack right here. I'm um, gonna see how this looks on the camera, uh, real quick. Just up there at that corner. Oh, wait a second. Choose a Pokemon to attach an energy to. Oh, didn't do that yet. <laughs> cool. We're gonna open up this random. Detective Pikachu pack that I have here. Um, surprisingly, I've gotten a lot more into Pokemon kind of card collecting too, learning more about what makes like, um, from a collector standpoint, I really have only ever played competitively. Um, that's something I've learned a lot about on TikTok. So he, okay, we'll get back to this pack in just a second. He kind of had a rough start too. All right, can Turnus work with two Brad? It can, yeah, it definitely, definitely can work with two Crobats. There's other dark type dudes you can uh, supplement in there for. Uh, let's see, now we just got a retreat. The slump I kind of just want to keep stacking more energy. My opponent kind of had a slow start. Uh, let's see. This is what we're gonna actually do. Actually, uh, here, I'm gonna go ahead and throw this Wondrous Labyrinth out here because that's gonna definitely hurt him from being able to attack next turn. Um, Put two Pika Rums out there. I really don't want to have both out there. It's just as bad to have the den. I kind of want to keep one bench space open. Let's see. And electrify, and then we potentially. Can I get the tag bolt off next turn? Maybe. A couple things I'm missing. I can't believe neither of us have taken a knockout yet. Um. Let's see. I don't even know if I start. Like I said, I'm starting to burn out just a little bit. But, oh, shoot. I realized that's super late. Tapu Koko's prize. This makes Tapu Koko's prize anyways. This gives me more reason to want to keep getting off uh, Bol um, Bolt Storm. Okay. Um, this gives me even more reason Hopefully he could go ahead and try to bump this. Go, cool. let's open up this back real quick. Um, I should have noticed a lot sooner that that, that type of Coco. So we have one random Detective Pikachu pack. There, surprisingly, I was totally unaware that there was even a Charizard. Um, and 36, 36, 90, 30, 60, 90, 120, 30, 60, 90, 120, 82 10 i'm so close to being able to get a knockout on this guy but let's go ahead and just keep powering up 
<laughs> I think he's dead drawing right now too. Um, what would be the ruling? There's one ruling I ha I would have to ask one of my judge buddies on. I don't know if Wondrous Labyrinth adds on one cost more for the attack. I don't know if that bumps this tag bolt up to seven. I don't actually I don't actually know the rule of ruling on that one. So it's been a weird match. <laughs> uh, but this at least um, that's an interesting ruling. The open turn to three max. Let's see. I'd have to check how many VMAXs I have. That might be where I have to, like, kind of cut off a little bit. But I could see... I could open up a couple Darkness and Blaze booster packs. And we could see if I hit another dark, if I hit another one. Um, let's see what we have here for this Detective Pikachu pack. So... I actually don't know what I have here on screen right now. Uh, we have a cute little Jigglypuff. We got a Psyduck. A Magikarp. One of my favorite Pokemon, Magikarp. And a cool-looking Arcanine. Sweet. First official booster pack opening here, too. Um, so now I need to do a couple things here. So <laughs> this has been a super awkward match. Uh, I don't even know what the right play... I don't know what the right play is here. Uh, I'm going to get some knockouts, but it's not going to be enough. So at least no tag bolt is good to go. I can, mm, and I miss one uh, scoop of net too. So just not really anything good to showcase this deck in its prime. But I can take two prize cards at least. Seventy. Oh, three. Uh, he is only. If somehow he doesn't get the knockout, we'll take three prize cards here. Like I said, I'm starting to get a little burnt. A uh, little tired. I've been playing. I've played a lot. It's morning, of course. Thanks for checking out the live stream. Um, ooh, um, no, bosses weren't reason for that. I thought there was. What else was bosses were included in? If I can track down one of these coats, Chris, if there is one for the coats, yeah, of course. So he finally popped off with his turn in this deck. Um, and then I'm going to go back. Probably probably in the live stream with ADP. Um, didn't really get to showcase this deck super well. As Is there any way I could come back? He takes three prizes there. We still get a surprisingly amount of energy back into play. Let's see. There was a couple things that were missing. I had my scoop and scoop a net or something was missing, even though I took three prizes. Um, honestly, attacking this guy up front isn't a bad idea. Just trying to knock out an Eternatus. I think that's my game plan. I shouldn't. I shouldn't quite surrender. I haven't hit a heads all night on Turbo Patch. There we go, a heads. Um, there we go. We can actually possibly get a. Lolan Raichu Raichu kind of powered up and then I shouldn't I shouldn't sell this match out yet uh let's see and I should have remembered I could paralyze too I didn't think about that either um no I have a switch in my hand uh, for uh it's not likely I'm going to win this match but let's let's play it out Lightning energy. I think I have some switches and still stuff in my deck. So two. So worst case scenario, I get to attack him up front here uh, with Bolton. Uh, he's probably going to try to go to knock out my Raichu. Uh, let's see. Is there anything else I want to do? I would like to hit another Marnie. Actually. Even though I have that boss's order in my hand right now. Uh, no, something else is prized. So that boss's order is the only thing I have here. So I don't have another energy. This was closer than I thought it was going to be. Oh. 
And a crowbat's prize too. Okay, not a whole lot I can do. Uh, try to slow him down. Let's see. Who's got a higher tree cost? Actually, oh, I can't even attack either with Bolton because I have my sticking wonder it's labyrinth out here. Okay, now I'm gonna scoop this match. <laughs> uh, so I totally failed with the moment demonstrating my uh, awesome Pika Realm deck that I was saying, but it, I have one. I promise I have won some matches with it. I'm gonna go back over to ADP I think to end the night. Um, I got a. I, uh, I was thinking for a second, Chris. I, th I was trying to remember what I know. What I'm making. I, I know what I'm getting it mixed up with. There was uh, the trainer toolkit had bosses orders. It has a bosses orders in it. Um, like I said, most of the places where if I've getting gotten codes from is from Potown. Like I said, that involves using actual money, but. Um, in case you're not having one to grind it. And I think right now, I think I only have four bosses orders, so I don't think I can help there because those guys are a little tough. Wait, can you check? Um, I'll check in a second. Um, and... Let's do some more, some more matches. Um, and then it kind of depends on if I can pull. And then, like, for... Uh, let's see. Uh, ADP, ADP, ADP. Hello, Lucky V. Um, Lucky V53. Welcome to the stream. Um, been streaming for a little while now. Um, just testing out some. Uh, playing, mostly been playing with ADP, been playing with some other fun decks too. Uh, I'm getting ready to play in a couple Pokemon tournaments here and there. I feel like if you don't have a team card. Oh, like a tag team card? Yeah, tag team card, tag teams do dominate, dominate the meta. Um, specifically this one right now. Uh, but there are ways... There are a lot of there are decks that are creeping up that are trying to find ways to counter it. We'll see. Pretty pretty good odds that I can get the alter creation off on turn one. It's so frustrating. It can be, um, but there's a lot of ways to also build these decks quickly. I've been talking to Chris over here all night um, about ways. That, the cool part is so tag teams. Um, it's such a power spike. Cool part is about tag teams. This time next year in this format. We won't be talking about tag teams because this isn't official. I, I, I don't have a way to officially confirm this, but basically all the tag teams next year are most like all of them are going to rotate out next year and it's going to be Sword and Shield onward. So we won't have to worry about these guys next year. Um, it's... I go back and forth on my feelings about ADP. I'm playing ADP right now just because it is super consistent. Um... Yeah, I feel kind of bad playing like a meta, a meta deck in the past um, in in-person events at Pokemon Challenge and stuff. I try to come up with a lot more like rogue type lists and stuff, but I'm getting ready to play in a couple tournaments. The tournaments uh, Pokemon's doing there, uh, they're doing another online, another online thing, um, and I want to play in that. I don't have as I'm, uh, I can't play as much on the weekend as I used to. So I'm playing this deck because it is uh, the best deck that's in the format right now. Uh, I actually don't want to hit anything else. I can grab another Zacian. Ooh, uh, Chris, I think Timon Chan 5566. Five, six. This is what I this is what I love about the Pokemon community. Um, if uh, if you see that, Chris, make sure you do say thank you, Timon. Um, like I said, I kind of, if I only have four, I do need all four of those right now. Um, but, uh, this time next year, I got a pure dark team and it's good against anything that isn't a tag team. Cool. Are you running in turn to V or is it another kind of dark deck that you're working on? Um, the cool part is there still are things that do counter this, this deck. Well, I wouldn't say hard counter it, but this is my, I didn't get the turn one turn is, this is my opinion about the format, I I am actually really sad we're not getting to play in this format. Robot Hydrogen. Cool. Uh, I think I've seen some kind of variations of that pop up. I personally think, uh, and this is a completely, uh, my own opinion, some people will completely disagree with this, that this is the best, like, 
last so the format we had last year um at the beginning of last season's format the do, the the deck that and I, I guess this goes from my argument why i i don't think adp should be banned because there's always going to be some other deck out there that's op this time last year it was mew and mew 2 tag team gx we didn't have any kind of ball search we the only ball search we had we had cherish ball so just gx's search for it and the only other thing we had was um pokemon communication at the start of last season that was all we had for search while adp is like adp eternity and mewtwo are the three top dogs there's still a lot of other things in this current format right now that's still based around it so like before i had added in kufant uh i auto lost to oh no my hold on i hope the live stream's not live stream's going on i'm gonna fire it back up in a second so get back up sweet i'm just buffering there lagging there just for a second um but but now we actually do have a lot a lot of other decks uh I hate to I understand that hatred um <laughs> I I really do um I'm happy the two the two cups I have won in the past year the past so I won a cup I won a po uh, higher profile Pokemon tournament in 2018 and I won uh, my last cup was uh um this past February both those tournaments I didn't have any tag team decks in there uh I was really happy. Uh, my favorite single prize attacker deck was Baby Blounds. Still is. Uh, let's see. But Baby Blounds just lost a lot of things to be consistent. But I could play a little bit with Baby Blounds after this too. Once per game. So the cool, the cool part is, uh, it's just that's just too much of you for a little effort. Um, let's see, Alter Creation. more it, it one thing that has changed too so and i actually there was a format i liked even less than this so at least in this current format where we're in a format so one the pokemon hp you're absolutely right is insane and it's busted that we have this that we even have pokemon that we're talking about pokemon when that half 300 hp when charizard and rush ram first came out and or pikachu zekrom is considered squid uh, i had a couple of friends that were saying pikachu zekrom is considered squishy now uh 240 hp used to be like the crazy amount um but then we also have v maxes now the cool part is about v maxes well i hope we get some other cool single prizes and i'll be happy to see him go um see this guy go when his day comes let's see sand breath See a couple things I could do here. Attach metal saucer. Um, there are a couple options I have. Um, we're still gonna be able to knock out. Actually, I'll knock out this colossal next turn. Um, the cool part about it's, if there is kind of a redeeming factor about these big guys, we have finally switched to a format that at least it's two hit KO. Um, when Charizard and Reshiram first debuted. It literally, we literally got to a format that was all one hit knockouts. Um, this is a, a one hit knockout right now, but when Charizard rushed around, it literally came down to if you went first or second. Three in your hand. All three in your hand. Discard, yeah. Uh, and I, I totally, I totally agree with that. Um, he's mean, the ADP. Uh, 